I'm... Hello, can you hear me? I can hear you. Hey, Glozelle. Oh, my goodness. Hi, I'm Glozelle from um, BlackCinema.com. I'm so excited because let me tell you, they put a lot of money behind your show. I've been seeing it everywhere. <laughs> I, like, I appreciate that. Really? Like they're doing a good, I'm like, oh, you better go. Okay, but since you were a billionaire, you could be doing the money yourself. Like, like maybe she advertised, okay, because they doing the most with this. And I've seen it everywhere. So when I got the junket, I'm like, oh, I know what they're talking about. Yeah. Oh, but I, I didn't know it was a real show. Mm -hmm. I was like, well, I didn't get the audition. I could do this. <laughs> I, thought, I didn't know it was a real. Oh, my goodness. Your life is that crazy. Uh, creative. Yes. That's for so sure. Did you they can only you have know? one woman with a bold lip on the show. So unfortunately, oh. <laughs> for <laughs> season <laughs> one, <laughs> it's just me with my red lip today. <laughs> when did you know, like, hey, uh, my life should be on television? Or, or I mean, do people come up to you or you're like, hey, let me pitch a show about myself or what? Well, Glow, I think you can relate to this, right? Like, I was just sharing my life online, you know, and it didn't feel like something that would be that funny. You know, it's just kind of, I'm just living. I'm a mom balancing a business. My kids are nuts. Everyone, can't you see this? And then sure enough, everyone was like, no, this is actually exactly what America needs right now. They need to see that families are crazy, that we have more in common than we don't. And it's a hot mess and we're doing the best we can. <laughs> I just think that it's amazing. And thank you for putting out, especially right now, because we all need a break and we all want yes. to get into somebody's life and even though it's chaotic it's mm -hmm. it's still uplifting and it's not negative yes. you know it's fun it's light hard it's a break from it all you know i'm like is that like is your manny real like how long have y'all known each other so i met him in the mall okay so just as just we've all had Girl, our no. trips where we come home with something unexpected this time it was eddie <laughs> And yeah, he's my real assistant. He helps out around the house. He handles chores, laundry, you name it. Like that's our real life. These cameras just came in and it's like a home video, but for America. <laughs> that is, so your your husband just puts a, he just uh, deals with <laughs> what? Like I'm bringing this person in, the cameras are coming in and thank you for handling whatever you can handle at home. Oh, yes. God bless him. I mean, I always joke that I'm the gas and he's the brakes. OK, so I'm the one who's like, let's do it. And he's like, no, pump the brakes. Hold on. How are we doing this around here? He's a trooper. I don't know how he deals with me, but 11 years in, he's figured it out. <laughs> now, are there some things you're like, OK, let, let's not talk about this. Let's not talk about that. You have like, a, you know, some kind of I don't want to say protection, but like there's certain topics that you won't go to or, hey, this is our life. We're going to put it out there. Sure, I think everybody has like healthy boundaries, right? But because the cameras were in our house, they pretty much caught everything. I mean, I couldn't tell them, don't go here, don't go here. They had the camera, they were filming. What they caught is what they caught. So it's the real look at a real family. Oh my goodness. So um, how do, do you even prepare? Like you just live your life or do you make sure like, let me sleep with like a little foundation on, like let me, shoot, you know, like are they, like, do they, is it all the time? Well, so they Because everybody thinks they can old... be in a reality show, but like, right. when you're really in it, I don't know. Right, well, I mean, we're not the Kardashians. They weren't walking around right. with cameras 24 seven, but you know, we knew like, hey, it's nine o'clock, they're gonna be at the house. So, you know, I did my eyebrows, grabbed my wig. I did the bare minimum, tried to make sure I wasn't a whole hot mess. But there were some times where you'll see on camera where I've got the bonnet on, my granny PJs from Walmart, because that was what I was ready with. So. Like I said, it's a real picture. And honestly, I think a lot of people are going to relate. Oh, definitely. Oh, definitely. Now, do you think, was everybody on board that's on the show from the jump where they're just like, okay, yeah, let's just go put it out there. Well, absolutely. Everyone on the show was absolutely like, yes, I want to do it. Now, I have an older daughter who's in her 20s, and she was like, mom, I do not want my 20s being filmed for all of America. And I was like, I get that so my elder daughter she absolutely is in college she's living her life and you'll see a little mini glimpse of her on the first episode but for the most part she is all out but the rest of my family they are leaning all in 
Now, do you have some family members that, you know, coming out the woodwork, or, you know, I, I want to be on the show, too. You know, I'm like, like, you know, I'm your cousin first removed to, you know, on, on your dad's side, you know. <laughs> Absolutely. I'm African. Are you kidding me? I've had 15 oh, emails yes. from 10 Nigerian princes who are telling me about yes. how they need to be on the show and get their cut. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So you, so we, how many, like, how long do you want to go? Like, you want to, like, this is going to be. Like the Kardashians did like a hundred years. You want to watch everyone grow up and go on and. I mean, I think that this is going to be something that I'm really focused on for the first season, right? And we'll see what happens. I mean, honestly, I think we're willing to be around for as long as America needs us, you know, as long as they want that lighthearted break, you know, and to see a positive, loving family on TV that just makes them laugh, you know? So as long as they'll have us, we'll be here. All right, that's great. What well, what's the takeaway that you? I mean, I guess that is the takeaway. Is there anything else you mm -hmm. want us to take away from your your great show? Of uh, she's the boss is uh, amazing. Like I said, it was everywhere. I'm like, okay, Nicole, okay, okay, Nicole, okay. <laughs> all right, this Nicole, okay, Eddie, oh, like, okay, Alex, like, okay. I'm knowing everybody before I even you know got the joke. I'm like, this, these people are real. You know, like, wow, that yeah. is fantastic. I think the biggest takeaway that I hope everyone sees is that it's possible, you know, that families are made in a lot of different ways. You know, you can adopt, you know, you can have extended neighbors that become family, but whatever it is, it's legitimate and it may not look like your family, but we can all relate. And I really hope that it helps us all find some more common ground because we need it right now. Now, is it unusual for, um, you, I know that you, your parents are from Africa and you're from Africa. Is it unusual to adopt is that because like oh, in yeah. you know african-american um we, we're like ah you know within the family but uh is that unusual when it's like you're supposed to have 15 children of your own oh make no mistake my parents are still checking for my uterus okay they're still like really you can have more babies absolutely but I think that what we forget is even in the African American community, we're always taking in somebody's kids. You know what I mean? We're the that we're part. Family, we're aunties to everybody. And so for my parents, they're like, yeah, it's not that weird that we have extra people at the table, you know, but we still want 15 grandchildren. So it's a little bit of both. <laughs> okay. And do you, uh, so your husband is good as like, he's a lawyer, right? But he's like, okay, so I'll, I'll be the one to stay home. And he is cool with that. He's not only cool with it, he's my lawyer. So he works for my company. So he's cool with it and he gets a check. <laughs> oh, right. that's a good thing. You, you, she's the boss is uh, the correct title. <laughs> all right, everyone, make sure you watch. I cannot wait to watch all the episodes. And I hope I get a chance to talk to you again. You're gorgeous and such an inspiration. And I, I love the whole family. And I can't wait to, to continue to watch. Okay. Well, Thank amazing. you so I much. You. Thank you. Yes. Okay. And you just cute the boot. Ah. Bye. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You're amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Take care. Bye.